first thing we have to do is prep the instrument, what we call our pickle, or an acid bath. Ours actually is a synthetic acid. Um, it breaks down in the environment, so it poses no hazard to the environment, it poses no health hazard to me, it poses no health hazard to my customers, and it's a lot more delicate on the finishes and everything in the horn. It was invented, manufactured right here in Springfield, Missouri, and uh, but I know we're the first shop in the nation to be using this. And this preps it for our ultrasonic machine and gets the big chunks off it so it'll be that much more effective when we put it in. Then once it's soaked in here, pull it out. brush out all of our uh, reachable surfaces with this brush and remove out all the gunk that has been loosened up by our ass. The second step is to polish all of our uh, outside pipes with uh, synthetic steel wool. Uh, it's kind of like scotch bright or green, all it's just less abrasive and it won't do as much damage or scratching or anything too prep. Next step, after we have it all prepped, we put it in our ultrasonic cleaning machine here. It's a 90 gallon tank, and we simply put our parts in here. The reason we use the ultrasonic instead of just using the acid is that the ultrasonic actually uses sound waves to scrub, and all the parts, I can't get those brushes I just used. So it'll remove all the deposits up in these crooks and um, up in the valve pistons or the other places in the horn where I can't easily reach, like the valve crook or a curved uh, mouth pipe like on a hornet. This is the same machine you'll find if you go to get your uh, jewelry cleaned at a jeweler. They use like a small version of one of these. This is just a 90 gallon version of the ultrasonic cleaning tank that your jeweler would use. And now we simply do our uh, Texas flush again. This is the last our step. We're going to polish all of our um, inner slides again, all our raw brass surfaces, this time using uh, a natural steel wool but using the finest grit available. This is made for um, smoothing out finish on lacquer and things like that. I recommend having this service done once a year. If you're a real heavy used player and you don't maintain your instrument well, you don't give it a bath a lot on your own, you're gonna wanna do this more like twice a year. For a uh, cornet like I have here, I would charge $69 for this cleaning. Uh, that also includes replacement of all your ports, of all your belts, all your springs, if they're uh, worn out or broken, and a valve alignment. I actually use synthetic corks instead of synthetic belts, and I use a, a boroscope where I can visually confirm that all your valve ports are aligned in there, and I use a synthetic belt. It comes at different thicknesses so I can put the exact right thickness on there and make sure everything lines up properly. It's playing in its top condition. But when it's, once it's finished, you can see it's very clean. There's no gunk on the outside of these slides. There's no green gunk on the inside. All the valves are clean. And I simply have to dry it off now, uh, re-grease it, put on my felts and corks, and I'll be ready to be uh, shipped out the door and get back to the place.